Hello everyone, welcome to another episode of SciKids Here. Today we're going to be talking about proteases and why pineapple doesn't set in jello. To understand this question, you first need to know what jello is. Jello is made of gelatin, which in its package comes as a tightly wound braid. When you heat it up in hot water, it splits into strands of gelatin. When you put it in cold water, it links up into a matrix and it traps in water, giving it structure, but the ability to wobble. Pineapple has a special type of enzyme called a protease. This specific protease is called bromelain. Proteases are proteins which are meant to cut up other proteins. In this case, bromelain will cut up gelatin, not allowing the gelatin to hook up into a matrix and leaving it as a liquid. I did an experiment to show this. I poured some gelatin solution into three containers. I put canned pineapple into one, fresh pineapple into another, and I left the other one plain. After I put the jello into the fridge, I studied each container. I saw that the container full of canned pineapple had its jello solidified. As you can see, but then the one with fresh pineapple had its jello completely liquefied. In fact, you can literally pour it out into a jar. Why is this? Why isn't the jello with the fresh pineapple properly formed? Whereas the jello with the canned pineapple is still solid. This is because that the bromelain inside the fresh pineapple was able to snip up each of the strands of gelatin, whereas in the canned pineapple, in the canning process, the pineapple had to be heated up, which inactivated the enzyme bromelain, causing it to split apart, making sure it can't snip up the gelatin. This is why the canned pineapple won't liquefy the gelatin. Just to make sure, I took the plain jello and I put a piece of fresh pineapple on top of it. Then, guess what happened? If you said that it liquefied the jello, you're right. The fresh pineapple's enzyme, called bromelain, even works on solid jello. It'll still snip up the strands of gelatin and turn it into a liquid. Here's the gelatin that had the fresh pineapple in it. As you can see, you can literally pour it out just as the one with the fresh pineapple put into it before the jello solidified. This leads me to conclude that the bromelain will always break down the gelatin. Now you can see a time lapse of the pineapple melting through the gelatin. As you clearly saw in the time lapse, you can see the pineapple sinking right through. This shows that the pineapple was cutting through the gelatin layer by layer. This is why fresh pineapple doesn't set in jello. Bye everyone, thanks for watching.